Hello everyone and welcome to the second season of the Acacia League with the qualifiers. Our first event will be chess. The rules are on the screen right now. On to our first run, the catastrophic elements. And they get an 8 here. And now on to our second run, which is the high ballers. With a much better run of 13, let's see... How that will do. Violet Nebula is now on the third run. And that is not so good with only five white caps up now. And they will get ten. A decent score here. Speeding trains in our fifth run. They will get an eleven here. And now Sapphire Spirals. Who will get a 10, joint with the white caps, and that will be our first tie. Cherry Clouds will get a 7, and now we move on to the Aqua Splashers, who will get 7 as well, so they will also be in a tiebreaker. Team Lemonade, now, who will get a 12? And now we have the Spiritual Psychics, our worst team in Season 1, and they get will get a decent score of 9 here. Mint Chocolate Chips, now, who will get an 8. And Earth Entities in our final run before the tiebreakers, who will get an 8. Our first tiebreaker here, the Cherry Clouds, up now, who will get a 12, and that is what they would have wanted in that first run. Aqua Splash is getting a decent score of 10, but Cherry Clouds will beat them in that tiebreaker. Catastrophic Elements will get a 10. Mint Chocolate Chips now will get an 8. And the final one in this tiebreaker is the Earth Entities, who will also get an 8. So they will finish equal with the mint chocolate chips in our third tiebreaker we have the white caps who get a 12 here sapphire spirals as well now who will get an eight and our final results high ballers will finish first team laminate second speed and trains third and now our second event swimming heat a will be panda and pollen and Away they go now, and Pollen very much out into the lead, and they will easily take that win. Spiral and Catastrophe in Heat B, and away they go. And I think that Catastrophe, who will take the win here and move on to our semifinals. Piston and Fortune up now and off they go and it's fortune out into the lead and they will take the win fortune what well, okay tsunami and whirligig two water-based teams and that's a pretty close one but it is tsunami who takes the win chocolate and limb now there we go, and it's Team Lemonade who will take it over the mint chocolate chips. Neb and Sky for these teams. And it's Sky who I think will easily take that win. And we move on to our semi-finals now. Catastrophe and Pollen up here who will move on to the finals and i think it will be pollen and on to our second semi-final here fortune and tsunami which will it be will it be the water team or the spiritual psychics and it will be the water base team sky and limb in our last semi-final, who will it be? And I think Sky will easily take that win. And we move on to our final now. 
pollen, tsunami, and sky. Who will take it as tsunami takes our bump off of sky, which allows pollen to take the win just barely. That slowed Tsunami right down, but Highball is currently in the lead in overall. And next up, Event 3, Sprint, Chameleon, Swirls, and Spearman in our first heat of the Sprint. And that will be Swirls who takes the win. As we can see in our replay here, it was a very tight... But as we move on to Heat B now, and that will be easily the spiritual psychics who take it here. As we can see in our replay here, there was no doubt about that one. Heat C, Jet, Fruit and Planetary. And Planetary will easily take that one. No doubt about that. As the replay here, you can see that Planetary just zoomed ahead of them. Kappa, Mali, and Train in our final heat. And that is an easy victory for Mali. 5th to 12th is set as we move on to our final. And that will be a win for Melly. Planetary will take second, Swirls in third, and then Telekin in fourth place. We can see the replay here. Yep. It was very close between uh, Swirls and Telekin, though. They will both have the exact same time, though. Team Lemonade and Highballers are officially qualified as we move on to the Funnel Endurance. We can see the members who have been opted by their teams selected here. And there they go. Us Entities dropping on three first as... It will be um, the speeding trains, I think, we drop on first to that final funnel. As teams already starting to drop on through. Highball is Cherry Clouds, Humanity, Tafa Spurs, Mint Chocolate Chips. Uh, entities, White Caps, as we're already on to our top three. Aqua Splash is getting third. Catastrophic Elements second. And Spiritual Psychics getting the win here. They will qualify as well as Team Lemonade, High Ballers, Aqua Splashes, Catastrophic Elements, and White Caps. As we move on to Group B here, starting with the Ghost Crabs in our first event, they will get a score of 6, and that won't be so good. Translucent Grass up now, 7, not that much better, honestly, as Sweet Dandelions, and that is not a good score at all, only 4 for them. Polished Emeralds with a score of 13, matching the high ballers from Group A. Our first new team, Team Canary, getting a decent score of 11. Next is the Chadders, also a new team, who will equal the Polished Emeralds with a 13. And the Pixelated Artists will get 14, which will break... Um, the record set by those teams. 11 from the Valdivians here. Crimson Owls up next, who will get a 10. Pretty decent for them. Sky Seahorses in our 10th run now. They will get a score of 8, which is okay. Caesars will get 7. Not that great, honestly. And Flying Colors will get four, equaling Sweet Dandelion's score, as they will go to a tiebreaker against them, and will get a seven. And Sweet Dandelion's, they will also get a seven, which means they'll be tied in the final result. Caesars in the second tiebreak with an eight. Translucent Grass now... 
who will get a nine, which will beat them. Voldivians in a third tie break with an eleven. That will be pretty good unless Team Canary can beat that, which they won't, and it will only be a seven for them. Chatters in our fourth tie break against the Polished Emeralds, they will get a 12. Polished Emeralds will need to equal their run to from before if they want to beat that, and they won't. They will only get an 8 as the pixelated artists come out on top in the first event. In our second event, Swimming, Heat A is Trans and Ossipodine. As they go up now, and Translucent Grass look to take the lead, and that was a very close run, but who got it? It was Trans. As we move on to Heat B, Yellow in Condensation up now, and Team Canary out in the lead, Sky Seahorse is clawing back, and that was also a very close run between the two, but it was Team Canary who got the win there. Heat C, Polished Emeralds, and the Crimson Owls, and there's no doubt about that one. Crimson Owls destroy the Polished Emeralds there. 627 for the Polished Emeralds, not too good. Flying Colours in the Voldivians now, and Flying Colours out in the lead, and they will take it. 390 for them. Heat E, Timber, and Chadder. Of, and it's the Chadders, I think, out in the lead. No, Caesars take it. Uh, Sweet Dandelions and Pixelated Artists are winner of the first event and they will take the win in this heat as we move on to our semi-finals. Trans and Yellow up now and it's Yellow out into the lead and they take the win. Trans couldn't quite catch up to them as Rim and Confetti are in our second semi-finals. Flying Colours, I think, will easily take that victory. 415 to 493 there. Timber and Bite in our final semi-final. And that's an easy win for Timber. 391 to 508. And we move on to our final here. Yellow, Confetti, and Timber. And Timber was out in the lead. Confetti almost caught up to them, but it will be Timber who takes uh, first place here as we move on to the sprint. Rose, Canopy, and Ossipodine up here. And that's an easy win for Ossipodine. As they are competing in back-to-back -back events. I'm not sure why they opted for that, but it, it seems to have worked out in our first heat. Crim, Colour and A-Gate in Heat B. And that is very close between all three of them. We'll need to see this replay here. And let's see who got that. I'm not quite sure. And it was Krim who got it. Colour and A-Gate second and third there. And, but there's no doubt about this heat as Bird takes the win here over Evaporation and Picture. As we see our replay here, yeah, that was never in doubt for Team Canary. As our final heat, Grass, Ali, and Chadster, and that will be a win for Chadster. Ali and Grass with equal times, as they will come joint second. As we move on to our final here, Osipadine, Krim, Bird, and Chadster. And it will be the Chadders who take the win. Team Canary gets second, Crimson Owls third, and then the Ghost Crabs in fourth. How will that affect the standings, though? We see the results here. Chadders up in the 
lead right now. No team is guaranteed to qualify as of yet, but it will take a miracle for Sweet Dandelions to qualify as they opt to choose their reserve in this event. That's an interesting play from them as the pixelated artists are dropping through first. Team Canary, I think that was. But who will drop on through first? It is the Sky Seahorses, Ghost Crabs. They won't qualify. Voldivians, Shadows, dropping through pixelated artists. Flying Colours as we move on to our top three. Caesars in third, Translucent Grass in second. Sweet Dandelions will get first place here, but I don't believe that is enough for them to qualify. And it isn't, as Crimson Owls drop out of the qualifying spots and Translucent Grass will take that spot. We'll see you next time for Event 1.